My name's Madison Coombs and I'm studying Arts Commerce. I'm studying European Studies and Political Science under my Arts degree. My name's Derek Bailey. I study Arts and Law under my Arts degree. My major has been German and Arabic. I chose ANU because I felt that it was the best choice in terms of my courses, European Studies, Political Science especially because of our location and because of additional programs that we have, like the Washington Internship. Political Science and International Relations at the ANU is a, is a long-standing sort of strength at the ANU. When it was founded, the ANU was designed to be a think tank for the government because there was abundance of prestige and money. They were able to bring in the best and the brightest, which certainly helps our international rankings but also attracting the best students. The Washington internship was a placement I did with political science. I was with the Republican majority of the Oversight and Government Reform Committee and being with the majority allowed me to do a lot more work. I was more first-hand in topic areas, drafting and researching and it was just really cool because it let me see what actually happens versus what we learn on a textbook and experience it first-hand. Living in Washington was really interesting. We experienced snow days, transitioning to actually working a real job and being expected to remember to do things yourself rather than being prompted. It was completely different to what I expected in terms of the experience, the political parties and even just the buildings and the way it all is over there. I chose to study languages alongside law because I really appreciated the opportunity to diversify my legal study and I think that in this day and age you really have to pick something that makes you stand out from the crowd when you want to apply for jobs. Once the students finish the first year and the second year, we take them to a course where it is applied Arabic and that's in country. The students would be in the real environment of that language, but also the history, the culture, where they really see how they can fit in and how can they improve on their skills. In my Arabic program, I first undertook a language course in partnership with Zayed University in Dubai. From that, I was luckily put in touch with Dubai International Finance Centre Courts and to an internship. I've also been invited to participate in the Qatar debates run by the Qatar University. On the German side, I've done an exchange to Freiburg in southern Germany, which was sponsored by the German government. I have a job in the United Kingdom with an international commercial firm, which I start next year. I am really quite sure that if you graduate with an arts degree and particularly in languages, you will be able to go and maximise your potential later on in your career. I've had students go off and do interesting things like government, public service, NGOs, and consultancies and private firms and big banks. Lots of our students go overseas to do further education, to undertake either UN work. Simply put, an arts degree from ANU prepares you for anything you really want to do. Coming here in the past four years has helped me get myself ready for a job and think about the concept of that. In terms of art specifically, it's allowed me to try many different subjects. I wasn't originally a politics major or European studies major. The diversity in the model itself allowed me to try those and tweak out what I actually wanted to do down the track in terms of a job or future study, which was really good. I haven't looked back from my experience, been really happy with what I've chosen, um, and I'd do it again. What's really obvious from day one is that all of the teachers at ANU really care about your academic outcomes and really care about you as a person. I really appreciated that aspect of the teaching and I hope to really stay in touch with them after I graduate as well. No matter what you decide to study, you can expect to have people who are there to promote your well-being and to really make sure that you achieve the best you can. The best piece of advice I have is to follow your passion and really give it your everything.